What's, What's up, up everyone? everyone? Welcome back to our channel. It's Ooh. Danny and Nick. And we have some exciting news for you guys today. <laughs> we and can not believe we're saying this, that we're doing this, especially we just made a couple videos and we're like, how to save money. Well, let's just tell them first. Ready? We're going to, to look, look at, at all office the space. space. For Tales of Puff, and like I was just about to say, like we just keep telling you guys, like save money, work in your own space, like we don't need to move. But then at the same time, We're we keep saying our basement. We keep saying that our goals for the new year is to hire people and to grow our business, obviously. And we're not positive we're doing this. We're just simply going to look at a place that looks perfect online, but you never know. Um, but to grow and to hire people, we really need a different facility. Our basement isn't going to cut it for much longer, but there are obviously problems with getting a space. Then we have to physically go to work every single day instead of having the convenience. But this place is close by, super nice. Um, and it's just starting the process of looking, which could take a long time. But the biggest downfall is that they have a three year lease and we just are very, very hesitant about signing something for three years when we have it's like, it's time. been one year. We have no idea what we're going to be like in three years. Will we outgrow this space? Will we be out of business? Like we just have no idea. So we're not sure, sure if that's negotiable, but what happened was yesterday, Nick and I went on a run. I brought the idea up that we knew someone who had potentially a space. And, and we I, talked about this for a long time, but yeah. not like in concrete. Well, I was like, what do you think about asking this lady that we know about her space that she was trying to rent out, but it's been a while. So like, we don't even know if she still has the space or not. And but, so I just brought up the idea to Nicholas. And then when we got home, well, he was really, really interested. He was like, this is a great idea. Like, let's think about it, obviously. So I got home and I was looking up other spaces, not just that one we had in mind. And then there's two that are really nice. And so- And really close. Really, really close. Really, really nice. Um, almost perfect for what we're looking for. So I messaged the guy for the one place and I was like, hey, can I just have more information? And he was just kind of like, what kind of information do you want? Like, here's the square footage and here's the <laughs> price. Like, what if it was already on the listing? So then he was like, do you want to come see it tomorrow? And this was like last night at like 9 p.m. Yeah. So then I was like, Nicholas, do you want to go look at it? So we are going to look at it right now. We have no idea like what to expect. We don't really have that many questions. Like in my head, I'm like, when we move, we're gonna probably have new furniture and like we know for sure that a cutting table is something we want And so like I should have known what kind of size and brought a tape measure with us today I didn't even tell Nicholas I thought about this, but like we're not doing that Like we're just simply going to look I don't want to get my hopes up and then when we come back if we still like it Then maybe we'll go back again with a tape measure to see if the space would even yeah. fit like a giant cutting table and things like that We're super nervous like overall and we're not quite sure how much footage we'll be able to get inside but we will try our best to show you guys a little bit yeah. about what the Tales of Pup headquarters could be one day and it could be soon. How does this make you feel? Nervous, but I'm excited. Ooh. Do you think he's gonna treat us nice for yeah. being young? Yeah, I mean, he's gonna want our business, I'm sure. You don't come look at a business space if you're not serious, I feel like. All right, let's go, we're gonna be late. Look, one of these signs could say Tales of Pup one day. Is that it right there? On the right. Oh yeah, it looked black, I think. Like black shutters? That, it must be that. All right, wanna pull over here? Yeah. He got a little bit of clips in there, but the hard like thing is the just... phone zooms in so much, so like it makes the rooms look way smaller than that's they are. probably what they used for the photos. The space was way bigger than it looked online. We didn't put my seatbelt on, I'm so excited! So, better or worse than you thought? Better, I was afraid, better? yeah, I think it's really nice. It has three rooms. I don't think we knew how many rooms it had. It has three rooms and a big area in the middle. It has a giant bathroom. It's the only place in that building that has its own bathroom. It has its own private door to get in there if we wanted. Like, I think it's so nice. It is really nice. <sighs> I like the floors. Everything's freshly renovated. Mm -hmm. Really nice. And this, the people we met, one of the tenants, we were walking out. Like, just everyone was really nice. 
I'm excited to call my mom because I was telling her last night like that I just found this place. She's not gonna believe we went and saw it. Should we call her? Sure. Mm. Calling mom, sell old woman with light skin tone. Mobile on speaker. <gasps> she answered so fast. Hi. Hi. Are you at work? Yeah, I'm at work. Guess what we just did? Um, you bought a a office building. We went and looked at it. How's it look? It's pretty as in the pictures. It's better than the pictures because like, I feel like those pictures made it look so tiny. And it is, yeah. it, I mean, it's small, but it's spacious. Oh my gosh. It's a, Do, are they willing to work on the he price? Said, like, I said, well, not the price, but I said, oh. um, how negotiable is the three year lease? And he said, that he can do like an 18 month and then like with a notice he'd be fine to let us out. Oh, okay. He's like obviously like we we don't really want to do a one year lease so that's kind of like his wiggle room and I think that that sounds great too. I'm like well you know we'd be bringing all this heavy furniture and we don't want to move in a year either but it just would be nice to have the option if I mean I told him I'm like well I don't know if we'd be in business in three years or not so like. Right, right, right. There's two ways. Either be in business. Be in business or outgrow the space in right. three years, so. Right. So, thoughts on it? What are you thinking now that we're home? Well, I'm trying to be realistic. We're moving, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving. What are you doing? The moving dance. Well, there's a lot of positives. The location's amazing. The number of rooms is amazing. It's recently renovated, new floors, um, new paint, everything, so it looks really nice. The downfalls are there's basically no storage. So you no, turn no one of the in rooms into space. a storage, or yeah. each room would get a little storage. I'm not it's saying that there's storage. not a solution to it. I'm just yeah. laying out some of the problems. And then we didn't ask if the dogs can come. We also didn't ask how, I mean, obviously, the, when we were in there, we didn't hear people, but like, how soundproof is it? Right. Are we going to be annoying them with our sound machine? But the other benefit, I bet it's pretty sound. They have a conference room that you can book, which is really nice. And oh, what was I gonna say? I don't know. But I think it probably is pretty soundproof because you think about the confidential things that like attorneys talk about. Like, obviously they're not screaming like a sewing machine, but like, I don't know. We can ask if we're interested. Oh, I remember what I was gonna say. The price is actually very good from what I was thinking. Everything besides the telephone, which we wouldn't need, is included in the price. So that's really, really nice. True. So you, you know exactly what your monthly So now we all we need. Oh, 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 we what? also didn't tell them that we said that we were worried if it was going to be flexible on the three year lease. They heard my combo with oh. mom though. But yeah, yeah you can so tell us. Basically, he wants to get his That's money's a year and worth. A half, right? Yeah, he wants to get his money's worth because they just renovated. So they're willing to do as small as 18 months with like a reassessment. And if you know we want to leave or they don't like us, then you know we could it could be terminated then, which is a really good clause to have in there. And then if everything's going well, you extend for the next 18 months. A year or 18 months, I think, is totally fine. We you kind of know what you're getting into with that. That's the commitment. But three years is a long time, whether you're, like Danny said, outgrowing or the business isn't doing well and you don't want to have a space anymore. <gasps> we're moving, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving. We're, oh. What happened? <laughs> Holly just smacked me, or I smacked her. <laughs> we're moving, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving. We are moving to the groove in. Uh-uh. I've never seen Nicholas excited for Tales Up Top before. <laughs> so after seeing that, Nicholas, do you feel like you need to see more? Well, I don't know. We can look, we can maybe look up a few more office places, but for us, the make or break really has to do with the distance. We want to be able to be close to home and not have to drive too far, because it really starts to kill it if you're having to go drive a long way. Yeah. You're very dramatic today. You want to be an actress? No, I'd be terrible. Oh, the other thing that this place had that is so cool is a big room in the middle, and I could totally, I've wanted a like, can you photo show me what you got? Filming studio for so long. Not if your giant table is gonna be in there. We, we don't know what we're gonna set, how the layout's gonna be. Like Maybe this. the table goes in the cutting room. 
Oh, wow. That could be their big room. That was the other one, so I don't wow. like that. I'm showing him some inspiration, but you guys can't see right now. Show me the clips that you got. You're gonna be disappointed. Really? They're not gonna know what it looks like. Well, if you guys don't know, then you'll only know if we ever move in there. Obviously, we'll give you an empty office tour, and then we'll show you all the furniture that we get for it. Then we'll put it all together, and then we'll send it all up. And then we will be at Tales of Pub headquarters. Oh, he did. Well, you guys would have already seen this. Pretty. A toilet. Just wanted to show the bathroom. You got one clip. Two clips. You didn't even get the middle room. Y'all were in the middle room. Y'all were in the middle room. You know, you can't film when they're watching because they're like, why are you taking video no, of my space? No, it would have been fine, I think. Well, Danielle says that, but she wouldn't do it. So, that tells you something. I'm gonna pull up if there's any pictures. Here is your entryway. Oh no. Room? Oh, there's the middle room. Wait, this is so weird. When I look at my phone, it looks small, but when I look in the camera viewfinder, it looks big. But that's the middle room, so a giant cutting table could be right there. Whoa. Oh, there's the toilet. Oh, no. Oh no. Well, there you go. That's your sneak peek. So with that, we are ending it with, we have no idea what we're doing and where the future is going. But we do know we're gonna be moving forward and there are definitely- I thought you were about to say, but we do know we're moving and you were gonna uh, make the decision right now and I was gonna yeah. make- We do know that we will be moving forward and that 2020 is gonna bring some exciting things no matter what they are. We are very excited about it and we hope you guys are too. Oh, we forgot to do giveaway. Oh, okay. Comment down below if you think we should move or not. <laughs> Do you think Tails Up Pup should get an office space or, or is not? it a stupid decision? Yeah. Let us know what you think. Comment down below. Don't forget to put your Instagram handle so that we can contact the winner. If you haven't already, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel. And we follow us on Instagram. Yes, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.